Hello AP Biology students, let's go over the ninth section in Unit 8. In this section, we're going to cover a topic called Simpson's Biodiversity Index. This is just basically an equation we can use to look at how biodiverse an ecosystem or a community is. You can see the equation that we're going to use. D is going to stand for the diversity index. In the equation, we take 1 minus the sub of n, which is the total number of organisms for a particular species, divided by a capital N, which is the total number of organisms of all the species, and then what we're going to do is we're going to square it. This is a better way of looking at it. You can see, again, this is the biodiversity index. 1 minus the sub of the lowercase n divided by the uppercase n squared. When we come to our number or the diversity index, it's going to range from 0 to 1. Zero represents no diversity in a community. This is a single species dominating that community, while a one represents an infinite diversity where each individual represents a different species. This is again basically looking at how diverse an ecosystem is. If you look at the two ecosystems here, you can see ecosystem A is much more biodiverse than ecosystem B. This is because there are just more variety of trees in that ecosystem above compared with below. Let's do a practice problem using this equation. You can see in this community, we have three species with relatively equal numbers. So again, we're gonna use our equation here. If we add up all of these species organisms into one final population, it's gonna equal a thousand. So what we do is we place each species divided by that 1000 number, that's the total population. And we're gonna add all of those together after we square them. 1000 squared is 1 million, so we're gonna place this down here on the bottom. And to simplify this, we can just put each species squared plus each other. And again, this is going to be one minus this number for our diversity index. So our diversity index is going to be 0 0.664. So again, what does that number mean? Remember that the biodiversity index ranges from zero to one, one being the largest amount of diversity and zero being no diversity. So a diversity of 0 0.664 is moderately diverse. 